Good morning, everybody. It's update time. Okay, so yesterday we actually closed pretty negative. We wiped out all the gains from Tuesday, and today we opened stronger. Actually, overnight it was it was uh, up a decent amount, but now we are negative. So what I want to say is that uh, first of all. You know, I don't like to look at short-term fluctuations, but I do this be as a service because I'm putting out these videos. Somebody very smart once said that riding a bull market is like riding a bucking bronco. That horse is going to try its hardest to throw you off, and you got to try to stay on. It's a lot harder than it looks. The fact is, every downturn raises doubt. People are wondering, should I sell? You know, they've had experiences with the market. It's risky. Uh, they feel like they want to sell. They want to run to safety all the time. Uh, and in the past, I was the same way. And I, I used to sabotage my own performance by doing that. I mean, I, the slightest downturn, I'd get nervous. I'd have no confidence. I'd sell out. Then the market would turn back up. I'd jump back in. Then I bought high. Then it would turn back around again. I would jump back out, losing money, and it was a process of getting chopped up. This is what happens when two things, when, when you really don't understand what is going on, uh, and also when you don't have the right information. Okay, The understanding what is going on part, that is our MMT training. Okay, That tells us better than any other type of economics or or, or market uh, punditry or analysis, that tells us the reality of what the situation is, okay? And then, uh, even above that, is the data that we have. And the data I am referring to is the fiscal flow data, which you hear me talking about all the time. Before I understood MMT, and before I knew about the fiscal data, and really, again, I'm, I'm probably one of the only guys in the whole entire world who analyzes this data the way I do. And it's in my MMT trader report. But this gives me absolute confidence. This is not some guy saying, hey, you know, buy gold because the Fed is printing money because they're doing QE. That's all bullshit. That was all wrong. The, the, that was coming from people who did not understand MMT and did not understand the reality of what was going on. So some of you, and you've been critical a little bit, saying, oh, you know, you, I, I'm ending up sounding like uh, one of those guys, just constantly bullish. But no, because I am looking at the numbers. You know, I am telling you now from the numbers that they're extremely strong, and it's giving me absolute confidence to ride this market higher, and it will go higher. I'm telling you that emphatically. Unless something changes very quickly, and I don't see that happening because the the spending is actually expanding. Okay, that that pump with the water flowing into the pool that is pumping at an even faster rate. And by the way, what is the economy? What is the economy? That's the sum total of all the spending. So if you're not looking at the biggest single spender in the whole entire world, then you might as well be reading tea leaves or throwing darts at a dartboard. OK, so what is today? Today is nothing. What was yesterday? Yesterday is nothing. It's people who want to sell because for whatever reason, doubt has been created in their minds. So let them sell. Let them sell. The fact of the matter is what is happening is positive in terms of the fiscal flows, the, the environment as described by MMT, it's all positive. That's all I can tell you. You don't have to listen. And you can criticize and you can troll me. At the end of the day, we'll see who's going to be right. All right? That's it. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.